Hi everyone, before I start today's video, I'd like to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, Hankotrade. Visit hankotrade.com or use the link down below to get started. They have some of the lowest spreads and commissions in the entire industry, starting from zero pips. That's correct, zero pip spread per trade. Check them out, really great brokerage. It's actually the brokerage I've been using for I'd say the past four, five, six months now. The broker I've been using my recent videos showing my, my profits. And if you follow me on Instagram, I post my profits there as well, every week and every month. Check them out, hankotrade.com or use the link down below. I'll see you in the video. How's it going, everyone? Justin again here. I know it's been about, what, like half a month since I've uploaded my recent video, but it was all for a good reason. So as you guys know, I made a story, not made a story, I made a post on my community tab thing on YouTube where you guys can respond. I've been posting some polls there. I actually made a post, and this is something I've been posting on my Instagram for almost two years now. There are a lot of scammers impersonating me on Instagram, even YouTube. You probably look at my comment section. It says Justin equals time. It says message me on WhatsApp. I, I don't even I don't even use WhatsApp, so that's how you know it's a scam. People impersonate me, and a lot of other people you follow on social media they impersonate us all the time. And what they do is they reach out to you and ask you to give them money so they can invest for you, which I never invest for you. By the way, you need to legally have. If you want to legally invest other people's money, you need to have a Series 7 license, maybe a Series 3. I forgot what else. You need to have these licenses. I don't have it. It's not worth my time because I don't want to invest other people's money. I just want to trade my own money. And that's why I teach it for free in person in my office, which, by the way, has been going really great. And this is why I teach for free online on YouTube, just giving you my knowledge that I've learned over the past going on six years now for trading. It's because I just want to trade on my own and just show people what I do, and then I'll let you run wild with the information, right? Now... Because there's a lot of people scamming, impersonating you, I decided to do something, invest my own money that I make from trading and my life in general. I decided to invest a lot of time, energy, and money into building a platform. And this platform is all centered around everything I do. This way, you know, if it's not on this platform, it's a scam. What I mean by that is next time you see in the comment section of Instagram, of uh, YouTube, or maybe you know someone on Telegram with my name and face reaches out to you saying, hey, give me money. You know it's a scam because now I can officially tell you if it's not on my mobile app, it's a scam. So I'm here making this video today to introduce you that I built a new platform, which it'll be available for Android, iOS, and a website. So phase one, we're pretty much almost done, and that is launching the iOS version. Phase two would be the Android version. Phase three would be the website, and then phase four, which is my favorite phase, which I cannot announce just yet, but it's gonna benefit a lot of you out there. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm actually going to show you my phone. I'm gonna show you the mobile app. I'm gonna give you a quick rundown of how it works, what it is. And uh, again, I built this app for you. I built it for my followers. So everything is in a central location, so you no longer have to worry about me not responding to you on Telegram, me not responding to you on Instagram. I know there's hundreds, and if not thousands of you who message me on a daily, weekly, monthly basis, and I never get back to you because it's so overwhelming responding to everyone by myself. But now I have a mobile app for everything. So let me go ahead, pull out my phone, and show you everything about this mobile app. Okay, so here we are. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. At the very bottom right, it's called Simple Signals. Simple name, right? So we open up Simple Signals, and this is the first thing we see. It shows you what signals are currently active. Everything here, it's all fake just for demonstration purposes until we officially start calling out signals. So all this stuff here, it's not real trade. They're, they're not real trades. We just had to add some random stuff to see what the app would look like, right? So here it is, you can scroll up and down. And yes, the app will be calling out, what, when I say the app, I mean me personally. I'll be calling out stock trades, forex trades, indices, cryptos, commodities, and uh, like metals, you know, like gold, silver, things like that. One of the main things that I love to trade are Bitcoin uh, because I use Hanko Trade, and you can trade Bitcoin on Hanko Trade. So I trade mainly Bitcoin, silver, and gold. But mainly Bitcoin and silver are my two main things that I really trade. Um, I also trade US 30 and some indices here and there, but I've mainly just switched over to silver and Bitcoin because right now they're like the best things to trade for me personally. So that's what I've been trading. And you can probably tell that by looking at uh, my recent YouTube videos where I showed my profits. It's mainly just Bitcoin and silver. So uh, that's what we're calling out there. And if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I have a signature stock breakout pattern that I get into. So I spot about 15 to 20 plus of these breakout patterns per month. 
and they usually break out by 50% to 1000%. It's like huge. We're talking huge breakouts, but the downside is you have to wait like a week or two. One time I had to wait a month for the breakout to happen, but it's all worth it considering, you know, if it's like a 50% breakout or a 200% breakout, it's worth the wait. But anyways, that's a surprise when the app comes out. Uh, but here, as you can see, it's going to show you what signal I'm currently calling out. And when you click on it, it's going to show you the stop loss entry and take profit. Again, the app is not financial advice. I'm not telling you when to buy and sell. I'm just simply showing you what I am doing with my personal trading account. And it's totally up to you if you want to follow that or not. Again, we're not telling you what to do. You're just getting an inside look to what I'm personally doing with my money, right? So here it's going to show you what trader. Now it's going to say trade called by Justin Mueller. You're probably wondering, well, that's pretty obvious. Well, not necessarily because in the future, we may bring on more traders to call out more trades. So let's say, for example, someone is specializing in uh, indices. Great. If I see a track record, a track record of them and their uh, history of trading indices, I could bring them on, right? So things like that. But for now, it's just going to be me. Here, I'm going to have a description of why I'm getting into the trade. I'm going to explain the reasoning behind it. And if you want to zoom in, you just click on the image and you can zoom in and out. So there you go. Also, you can actually turn your phone sideways. So let me go ahead and do this. And let me show you, you can turn your phone sideways. So this works on any tab that you're on. For obvious reasons, there's really no reason to turn your phone sideways. It looks way better, uh, you know, when it's facing vertical instead of horizontal. So let's just keep it like that. So here is that page. Basically, it's going to show you all of the open signals. So any Forex trade, it'll be right there. Any crypto trade, any season, we'll add a stock tab um, and a metals tab. So you can see gold, silver, platinum, all that stuff. Uh, but anyways, that will show you all of the active signals we have at one given time on the mobile app. Now, when we switch over, this is going to be the sentiment. So this is actually a feature where you can vote on where you think a pair is going to go for the day, week, or month. And it'll notify you at the end of the day, week, or month if your correction was correct and by what percentage or how many pips. I forgot how we developed that part. But it's going to let you know if you were correct and by how much. So let's say, for example, let's say I think... Uh, and by the way, you can ignore. <laughs> so with the liquidity provider that we have, it basically shows you all of the Forex pairs, even the opposite. So instead of it saying uh, GBP USD, it'll show USD GBP. You can ignore that. You're not going to see that when the main app comes out. This is just when we added the liquidity provider for all the pricing and the charts and everything, it showed us every kind of possible combination of a pair. So that's why these things that don't exist are there. So you can ignore that. You can ignore that whole USD GBP thing. But let's say you think USD CHF is going to go up for the week. Then what you can do is you click on it. It's going to show you a chart here. We just integrated trading view. In the future, we may integrate our own personal charts that we'll design, right? But for now, what you do, if you think USD CHF is going to go up, great. Do you think it's going to go up for the day, week, or month? Let's say I think it's going to go up for the month. I press month and then I click share. Again, I'm not actually voting. I, I'm just doing this for demonstration purposes here, right? And, and, and what it's going to do is going to show you how many people voted. So, and the reason why this is so important is because let's say we have 100,000 users who have the app. And imagine if out of the 100,000 users, let's say 10,000 of those people vote on a specific pair. It's going to give you a great inside look towards the real raw sentiment of what people think. The thing about these sentiment indicators, like you see on TradingView, it says, oh, this is a very buy, you know, the, the signal for gold is, is very bullish. Even though it'll tell you the specifications and the reasoning for that bullish movement on the sentiment indicator, you don't really know the technical reason behind it. But on the mobile app, this app, you will actually know how many people who are on the app, how many people think it's going to go up or down. And that's going to be very helpful for you who trade based off of sentiment. All right, so this will work for pretty much any Forex pair, crypto, metal, indice, stock, anything that we support in the app, you'll be able to vote on. Now we swipe over again, this is gonna be our history tab. And right here on the history tab is gonna show you how many pips we caught for the day, week, and month. It's also gonna show you how many trades we did for the day, week, and month. And it'll show you how many total wins we had for the day, week, and month. And last thing, it'll show you how many losses we had for the day, week, month. We wanted to display everything here so you can see the full uh, analysis of my trades and everything or you know the traders that we have on the app. We want you to see all the results there. And so it's public for everyone to see. We go over one more time. This is going to be the traders tab. We're probably going to redesign this to something completely different. For now, we just decided to add an image with the trader's name. Uh, when we click on it, what we're doing is the reason why this looks blank is because one side is going to have the about me tab. So it's going to give you an introduction about where I got started trading, my experience, what I specialize in. 
And then here, the social part on this social tab, the social part is actually gonna be like a little social media feature within the app where you can actually leave a comment and a like. So if you like the post, you like it, similar to Facebook, Instagram, things like that. And, uh, but my favorite part is the fact that I can post an image, I can make a post and you can respond and you could respond to other people within the app as well. So think of it like Instagram or Facebook, but built into the app in our own little design. So uh, yeah, this is why I'm saying if you really wanna get my attention, if you wanna message me from now on, you won't need to message me on Instagram or YouTube or Telegram, you message me on the app, you leave a comment and I can go and check. And so this is why I'm saying, now, if it doesn't come from the app, it's most likely a scam because there's a lot of imperson scammers out there impersonating me on Instagram and all these other platforms. You, chances are you don't know who is who, right? Even though my Instagram page is linked below my YouTube channel, so there's no confusion, people still get confused because I report these Instagram scammers hundreds of times and I have screenshot proof that Instagram doesn't remove them. Instagram says, we found nothing wrong with this account. It doesn't go against our guideline. Bullshit, what do you mean it doesn't go against your guideline? It's a little, it's a legitimate scammer. I have evidence that they're scamming people and they don't delete the page. So I am forced to sit here and create a platform, which you know I didn't technically have to do this, but I did this for you. So you guys can see what trades I'm getting into. You can vote on where you think pairs are gonna go. You can comment, you can like, you can chat with me in the app and you can chat with other people in the community. So I built this platform all in one. And it's gonna be a website, Android and iOS, all right? That's that. Now, let me show you my favorite part of the app. It's the profile. You can upload a custom image up here and we're gonna have Q and A. So everything about the app, explaining everything, what trades we're mainly gonna be calling out, everything would be listed here in the app. Here, uh, get more trades. When we launch the app, you'll learn about the pricing. Let me just, I can't, I don't wanna say the pricing now, but I'm telling you it's so dirt cheap. Literally any of you can afford this. Anyways, uh, when we go to the account settings, I'm not gonna do that. Editor, don't show that, had my email and everything. Uh, anyways, your account settings, that's where you can change your username and your email. And here, if you click on change theme, guess what? We have light mode and dark mode. Boom, light mode. So right here, when we go back and take a look at everything else on the app, look at how beautiful this is. Look at how beautiful this is. I personally like light mode better than dark mode, but dark mode does look just as sexy as light mode. So whichever one you like the best, you can have it right here. So you can change your theme between light mode and dark mode, and you can manage your subscription right here. So we haven't designed it just yet, but you'll be able to choose what kind of plan you want. And then you can rate the app. Uh, we have our privacy policy, terms and conditions, everything would be there, and you can log out. So that is the mobile app that I recently just built. Our ETA, so our estimated time of arrival, basically the launch that we're expecting will hopefully be by the end of February. We don't know just yet. I did my best. Uh, we've I think we took like three, four months to develop this um, for all platforms, website, iOS, Android. Um, first step is gonna be iOS, so please don't ask about any other platform. First step is iOS. Uh, but I did my best on social media not to tell anyone about the app until we were ready to launch, almost ready to launch, because I didn't wanna tell you, hey guys, we're gonna launch in December. And then guess what? Two, three months later, then we launch. And I, I know what it feels like when a company tells me, oh yeah, we're gonna launch in a month and then it takes a year, right? I, I hate that, I just hate that. So I, this is why I didn't wanna tell anyone and I wanted to wait until we were about to launch. So that is the mobile app. I hope you enjoyed the quick tour. Follow me on Instagram. We created a company page for it. It's called Simple Signals App. Again, I'll leave the link down below for this. We don't have any other page on Instagram for this app except for the one link down below. I'll put it up right here, Simple Signals app. This is the only one we have for the company. So please, if you see any other page, it's a scam, report it, right? Uh, the, the page Simple Signals was already taken, so I just added the word app at the end of it. So anyways, that is that. Um, you can also visit simplesignals.com. That is the official website. No other website is owned. Uh, when I say no other website, I mean, if you see another website that's built a week from now, it's not ours. It's a scam, right? Simplesignals.com is the official website for this mobile app. And when the app launches, we're going to add the link at the bottom of the website where you click on that download on Apple, uh, download on the app store button. We'll add it there so you can actually download it. Anyways, that is a mobile app. I hope you enjoyed it. And please, you know, excuse my lack of uploading videos frequently because I do a lot of things behind the scenes, not only for trading, free one-on-one -on -one sessions, and uh, you know, working on this with my developer. It's been such a pleasure working with developers. Let me tell you, I have such a huge respect for people who build platforms, people who code. It's basically a form of art when you think about it. And a lot of people don't really treat it with the respect that it deserves. I see too many companies treating their developers as, you know, 
dispensable. You know, oh, you're getting tired of the working conditions. Let's just hire another developer that's willing to get half of what you're getting in terms of pay. It's it, too many companies treat their developers and things. They don't treat them as human. But the thing I love about running a small business for now, right, is the fact that I get to actually work at a human level with the people and understand things and get to know them personally, understand the lingo behind it. And I really love, I really love developers. So if you're a developer, if you're a designer, you know, if you are a creative, thank you because without designers, the world wouldn't be where it, the world would not be what it is today. Think about it. Your entire life is based on design. You don't buy certain things unless it looks good, right? You, you have a certain apartment because of design. Design is what runs this world when you really think about it. So uh, design is basically one of the most important thing to human beings, believe it or not. Whether you think that's true or not, it actually is the truth. Design is the most important thing pretty much around here. Um, it dictates what you do. For example, I may buy a specific watch because of the design. I may buy a car because of the design. I may get a house because of the design. Anything and everything is pretty much around what's pleasing to the human eye and that'll dictate what we do. So anyways, that's enough me for rambling. And I just can't wait to get back into the routine of the videos. I just wanted to talk about the mobile app because I'm just too excited to launch it.